first day of shooting for my video for the first single for the second album. It's called Love Story. It's Renaissance-y, medieval-ish, um, yeah, Pride and Prejudice-y kind of thing. I just invented three new adjectives, and I'm very excited. The song Love Story is a song that I wrote by myself, and uh, I wrote it about, you know, this relationship that it travels from when these two people first make eye contact to when, you know, they figure out that society doesn't want them to be together to when they realize that love overcomes everything. I wrote the song and I kind of had the vision for the video in, in my head a little bit. I really wanted it to be back in time um, because I think it just kind of it talks about that love that could be in any time period, you know? The Romeo and Juliet can't be together, but love pulls them together kind of thing. I thought that was pretty cool, and I think that can happen in the 1700s or the 1800s or 2008. I'm excited about this video because it's so different than anything we've done. It's a lot different than anything that you see in music videos today, just, you know, the period piece thing. I think that that's something I've really looked forward to doing um, for a long time now, so I'm very excited about taking people back in time a little bit. So this is Wardrobe World for Taylor Swift's Love Story video. And of course, we have a big dress. We can't do a video without a big dress, right? Uh, she has a 18th century um, period gown, two of them actually, one for the ballroom and one for performance. And then she also has her contemporary wardrobe for the campus. This is her corset. Look, it's so tiny. It's like a doll corset. I did design this dress, but with inspiration from Taylor, she loves to have input on her dresses. We've been talking about this gown for about two months, maybe longer. What is the Love Story gown? These are little bands that are we're going to try for, for her arm on her dress. Just a little delicate piece that will um, replicate some of the pieces that women had on their dresses in the 18th century. I'm looking most forward to the, the clothing, to the dresses and like all the outfits that are from the, not actually from the 17th century, but look like they're from the 17th century. Just kind of a different look than we've gone for before. So I'm very excited about that. I'm excited about, I don't know, just the fact that Trey and I wanted to do this video forever. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Huh? Video. I'm very excited, darling. Have you seen the castle yet? When I first got to the video set, I thought the castle looked amazing. And I was wondering, like, how are they going to find a cool castle in Tennessee? There isn't a plethora of castle options in the area. Um, but we are so fortunate, so lucky that we have this beautiful, amazing Castle Gwen, which is not far from where we all live. You know, it's funny. The castle, we actually kind of home the country for a castle first. You know, we even considered going to uh, Europe for castles. And uh, in Nashville, we never, I didn't know this castle existed. I mean, uh, you know, a lot of the castles around the country are in ruins and kind of broken down. And this castle was actually uh, built in 1973. And some friends of mine sent me some pictures of the castle. And I thought, well, man, that castle could actually probably work. I just didn't think that, ca that castles were in Tennessee at all. Now I know, Castle Gwyn, it's awesome. I'm told that this is going to be the hottest day of the year. Hottest day of the year. Hottest day of the year. Record hottest day of the year. Well, what you do is you go down to the local, <clears throat> grab your little fan, and just keep it going. I also have one that's got water that comes to it. But anyway, this is going to be a lot of fun. I can't wait to see it. This is like a little mini movie. So you got to stand by. It's going to be a blast. We're walking to the castle. This outfit is um, it's a very, very long dress, and it has lots of layers. And um, I've got like all, like period piece shoes on, like white tights, like total period piece everything. I've got like the headband, the antique necklace, the sleeves that they just made about two seconds ago. It was pretty exciting. It's uh, it's comfortable right now. It won't be in five minutes, but. But it's comfortable right now. I'm in the blissful state of like, oh, I just put a corset on. I can still breathe. Corsets are really tough to wear just because it's like. 
like smushing you in and like, you know, you become an architectural structure. There's no room for inhaling at all. So you've got like a, like a 20 minute period of time where you're not feeling like you're gonna, your lungs are gonna collapse and after that, you're pretty much feeling like you could be on your deathbed. You know, if there are any shots in the video where I look like I'm gonna faint or I look like I'm in pain, I probably am. I am forcing it in and it really hurts. Ah, oh, this is tight. Wow, this is tight, this is good. It's a very tight corset that I'm wearing right now. There are times when everybody gets stressed out on video shoots. You need to be in the field, guys. Get out of my shot, way down there, thank you. They're just running around and they're, they're crazy. Get down, get down, get down. When we were driving back from the field, there was a little mishap. Ah! Oh my God! Right now what we're doing is I am pining away for a guy. Um, who is, I'm waiting on him to come save me. We found the boy uh, for, the, for the role. His name's Justin Gaston, and he was on Nashville Star. I really started looking for the guy for this like six months in advance. And I would watch movies, and I would write down the names of people I thought looked awesome in there, and this is so random. I was watching Nashville Star, and... I kind of mentioned that, that I liked her music and things like that. And I think she heard about that and asked me to do the video. So here I am. And so I, uh, I called up my label and I was like, we need to get this guy for the Love Story video, like, ASAP. They were like, well, he's locked down. If you're a contestant on Nashville Star, you're not allowed to do anything. So, you know, one thing led to another and he got kicked off, which, bad for him, but kind of good for me, you know? Now he gets to be in my video, so I'm excited. And I think he's perfect for it. Yeah, that's good. Okay, cool. Thank you. Let's check the game. Oh, I just learned that I won a Teen Choice Award. Like, they just called me and told me that. Um, the Teen Choice Awards were last night, but it wasn't a televised award. And, and I wasn't there when they did the Teen Choice Awards. I was in Charlotte, North Carolina, playing a concert. I didn't know that I won until right now. It's really cool. I'm really excited. Mom! I won the Teen Choice Award! They do this thing on video shoots called playback, and it's when they play your song back so that you can sing along, so that you can get the words right, and sync up everything perfectly in perfect timing. And um, <laughs> well, they had a chipmunk version of the song. This is way fast. Okay. Somebody had messed with the song and made it really fast. They sped up the track. Why would they do that? And the vocal was like, and it was like, it was ridiculous. It was, so I had to get out my iPod and play the regular version. Racing the sun. So before we do the change, you want to shoot her running? Let's do it. And roll camera and action! And action! Action! And action! Okay, camera reload. Chop, chop. You heard him. This is the phone call. We're chasing the sun. Action. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Oh, Woohoo! Got that? She wanted overhead. That was cool. Okay. So what are we doing, guys? Are you going to the 40? Yes, ma'am. Cool. Are they over? Okay. Okay, great. Are we going to see the deep breath? She's wanting a reaction. There's a moment, like, it's to see more of her. It's so wide. Sure. We've got the wide. So let's drive in. Let's drive in and see her. And action! Yeah, 
Right. You need another one? Nope. <laughs> Does that mean I get to go to the car? Okay. Not yet. Not, not quite yet. We've got one more. Angle right here coming, and we're cameras right here coming at us. One more. We gotta go. We gotta go. Let's hey, shoot this. Shoot it. Shoot it. Shoot it. We need to be in the field, guys. Let's do a 40 mil on this. And then we'll do a lens change. So Off that, we'll do a lens change. Okay, great. Great. Let's, Let's get field. it. Good job. Good. Awesome. We're good to go. So we finished up all the balcony shots where I am performing and pining away and such. And now we are on the way to um, the second setup that we're doing, which is um, Romeo and Juliet running to each other in a field, which is something that I've always wanted to do, like a, a scene that I've always wanted to do. This is the prettiest field I have ever seen in my life. Where's Trey? I love her. Trey, I love this field! Are you kidding? Way we, have, we gotta go. Oh, yeah, look at the sun. Let's go ahead. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's go. Quickly, quickly. There are times when everybody gets stressed out on video shoots, and Trey and everybody is they're, they're just running around and they're they're just they're crazy. Okay, so we only have one chance to get this right, Ramon. Make yep. sure you're focused. Yep. What frame rate are we at? We're at 40? 40. 40. Okay, here let's we go. go. Let's go. Let's go. Please don't get in my way. Yeah. I've seen her do this before and it's so funny. And she comes out of it in two seconds. I get nice after the sun goes down. Let's go. Trey's gonna get out a rifle. Trey, duck down a little bit too, please. Everybody was so stressed out and they're just like, shoot, run, go, go. Get out of my shot, way down there. Thank you. The thing that de determines a lot of, you know, aesthetic beauty and stuff like that in videos is the sun. All right, guys, here we go. And rolling. Action. When the sun is at the right place in the sky, they want to capture that moment right there. And if the sun starts to go down, they have like 30 seconds to get everything they need. Wherever they tell me to go, I sprint there. Justin, go! Yeah, Justin, go. Run, Boris, run. I've learned this. You, when they tell you to go somewhere and they're in that freak out time where the sun's going down, you run. It doesn't matter if you're in a floor length 1700s ball gown. In a field, you run. Cut. Okay, guys, we're out of here. Let's Good. move on. Yep. When we were driving back from the field, there was a little mishap. I need printer cartridges. I made a new friend that apparently decided to come along for the ride in my dress. In color and black. I have not noticed an office supply place anywhere around here. I know, it does ah! I don't care. It's dead now. Oh my god. Spiders are like my worst. I don't know that I'd touch it. Were you guys scared? I wasn't scared. Well, you yelled. I was very excited to see him. So, uh, ah! I thought no. she was reacting to my comment about was... no office supply place, right? <laughs> I was like, whoa, Gosh, calm the down. There was no big deal there. It was just a little spider. There's <sighs> no issue. Oh, gosh. Love that you I'm posted that on film. That's like my worst moment ever in, in my, the history of my <laughs> life. <laughs> Oh my god, we just had a spider emergency. But they killed it with my CD. They killed it with my deluxe CD. I just, I hate that because it makes me seem like such a girl, but that was a massive spider. It's brand and I'm just clear. sitting there and I'm like, hi, printer cartridges. Ah! <laughs> you know? I was going to try to save the spider, actually. But look at your instinct. But look at them. Look at them. They're just killing things all the time. Video day two. We're gonna be ballroom dancing. I've never ballroom danced before, so this is a first. And this is where what? you reach behind my back, right what? there. All right, so I just got here. Um, video day two, so it should be really fun. We're gonna be ballroom dancing. When I got here this morning, I knew that they were going to give me some dance lessons. Ready? And curtsy. One, One two, two, right? You know, I was really hoping One, the dance two, wasn't hard right. One, and that it wasn't that difficult because I basically had 15 minutes to learn it. And this is where what? Behind my back, right what? There. I've never ballroom danced before, 
So this is a first. And you're just gonna just do a little step to one side. Do it with me. What? Step to the side. Now with the left. Step. Beautiful. Step. What? Step. 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 We'll do it again. We'll do it a few more times. Then we'll bring Justin in so you guys can do it together. And by the way, I'll be right off camera going one, two, three. Hands behind your back. Walk around. Touch. Like I'll give you all those cues just off camera. That's good. So I feel like I'm kind of picking up on it a little bit. Like I'll miss a few steps or like a few thousand steps every once in a while, but um, it's like I'm not particularly incredible at dancing, but I'll try. Two, three, one, two, three, look at me and back, do it again. One, because it repeats four times. Oh! Yeah, the exact yeah. same thing. <laughs> we do that four times, you said. Oh! The choreographer Robert was really cool, and he was just so helpful in teaching me the steps, and he was a lifesaver, definitely. Yeah, draw the hand. That's fantastic. That is yeah. so rock and Thank roll. You. That is so fabulous. Thank I'm so you. impressed. That's, really? I'm really Thank impressed. You. Really, really impressed. I'm actually getting some of the moves down, so I'm pretty excited about that. About to change into full costume and go do it for real. You guys look amazing. Yes. I think I'm going to copy off of all the other girls, honestly, when we're in the ballroom scene. I'm just going to be looking over at everybody else and see what they're doing. And, um, yeah, I'm definitely going to copy off of other people. That was really good. Now make it a little tighter, right? Make, try to keep your straight line straight. So if you're not in a straight line, we're really going to see it right now. For the ballroom dance, we have about 20 other dancers, and they're all professional. They have all been practicing this dance for weeks. So I'm really excited about seeing how this works out. Line. It was the coolest thing ever. Highlight of the night. What does it mean? And that's, that's a wrap! Right. Stay tuned for my brand new video for Love Story. So here it is, the video for my song Love Story.